It's the middle of the night and liquid waste crews are at the Sperling pump station in Burnaby, inspecting a section of pipe with a unique looking device. So this evening we're doing a full pipe inspection using a free swimming electromagnetic technology called Pipe Diver to inspect our Sperling force main. This technology allows us to gather data on the condition of the pipe wall while the force main remains in service. The pipe diver works by inducing an electromagnetic current through the pipe wall. That signal is then received by these 24 fin-shaped detectors and provides a measure of the wall's thickness. So we're doing it late because we found that the pipe diver needs to go through the force main at a certain speed. We can achieve that speed between 2 and 5 a.m. because that's when most people are sleeping and there's less uh, usage of the washrooms and the uh, sewer system. The pipe diver begins its journey at the pump station where it is inserted up into the force main through a check valve. Once launched, it will travel 400 meters to the Burnaby Lake North Interceptor where it is collected. This operation requires coordination between several groups. We have an operations team here to operate the pump station and lock out the pump. We have Peer Technologies here who is uh, inserting the pipe diver tool and collecting the data for the force main inspection. And we have Absolute here to do the removal and installation of the check valve. These inspections are an important part of keeping our pipes healthy by detecting any erosion, cracks or clogging. Metro Vancouver reminds residents that grease goes in the green bin and not down our drains where it can clog our pipes 